The search has been going on now for about four decades, wow. but now an exploration group is saying that it has finally found Lake Michigan's oldest known shipwreck. French explorer Robert LaSalle's Le Griffin and its six-member crew disappeared in 1679 after leaving Washington Island. Ben Krumholtz brings us more tonight in a Fox 11 follow-up. The Great Lakes Exploration Group thought it found the long-lost Griffin in 2001 when it found this wooden beam sticking out of the bed of Lake Michigan. After years of court battles, excavation around the beam last summer found it wasn't connected to a ship. But the group says last week, about 120 feet southwest of where the beam was, it found what it believes is the rest of the Griffin. There's a lot of wreckage there. Steve Leibert says his group found a ship bow and planks. He says fasteners that hold the hull to different parts of the ship were also found. Leibert says the fasteners are identical to the ones you see here. These are from La Belle, which is another LaSalle shipwreck. La Belle was discovered in the Gulf of Mexico in 1995. That information was sent off to France. Uh, they're pretty excited. They definitely said that it's consistent with LaBelle. Leibert says the new findings support his theory that the wooden beam is the Griffin's bowsprit. State archaeologists haven't agreed. In my opinion, I haven't seen any evidence that suggests that uh, anyone has found wreckage of the Griffin there. Michigan State Archaeologist Dean Anderson believes the wooden beam is a stake used for fishing. That piece of wood uh, certainly bears a very striking resemblance to uh, a net stake. Three of France's top underwater archaeologists side with Leibert. They dove into Lake Michigan last summer. Right. Leibert says one of them plans to come back to confirm the Griffin has been found. There's no question about it. So, so we're pretty anxious. Now we just have to get the permits to uh, uh, excavate down. Ben Crumpholz, Fox 11 News. Leibert says he hopes to have federal and state excavation permits ready for September.